You guys? Care to explain? This is the best team I've used. By far. That's four in a row, by the way. The best team I've ever used. Ever. This is the meta. This is what you need to do in order to win. What's up, ladies and gents? I am back. Now, you guys may have noticed I was struggling a little bit with the all-speed team, and I was struggling a little bit with the all-power team as well. And I was curious why. I didn't know if I was overthinking it. I didn't know if it was because I was playing at Polo Grounds and I was getting bad karma for being toxic. I didn't know what it was. I did well with the Switch team. I did well with the all-lefty teams, but I'm trying to find a groove. Now, I am genuinely curious if power may be just overrated in this game. And what we're going to do this time is we're going to find out. We're going to find out for sure. So what we're going to be doing is similar to the all power, except it's going to be the complete opposite. It's going to be all contact. We're going to be using guys that have at least 120 contact against one of the hands. Now, these... A guy can have 12 contact against righties, but if he has 120 contact versus lefties, he's eligible to be used, all right? So that's what we're going to be doing in today's video, all contact guys. Now, some of you guys have been a little bit concerned with who I've been using and who I haven't been using, so let's get that part over with right now. If they reach the cap of what I'm setting, I'm going to try to form the team that I'm most comfortable with based on those restrictions. I, of course, I would rather have Willie Mays in my outfield than Lou Brock. Come on, guys. Let's be real. I'm still doing a World Series run. I'm still trying to climb leaderboards. You got to let me try to do my thing. I'm going to try to win these games. So as long as I'm following the rules, it should be all good. Yeah, Babe Ruth, I could have used in the all-power one, but I don't like using him. I'm still using guys that have all-power. So keep that in mind before you, you start getting on my head, all right? But I love you guys. Let's get into the all-contact. If you guys see anybody that I didn't use that you think I should have used, make sure to leave a comment below. Maybe I'll use them in the next video. Make sure to leave a like and subscribe on this video if you guys enjoy it. I appreciate all your guys' constant support. It's been really overwhelming and it's helped me a lot stay motivated to keep doing this. And as always, leave a comment below if there's any team builds that you would like to see me use. Of course, I'm always open to them. Let's get into building this team. Now, contact's something I haven't spent a lot of time like studying with these guys, so I'm actually going to need to refresh my memory on a lot of these. Of course, Honus is maxed out contact. Chipper Jones is going to be gone. He doesn't have it. Roberto Alomar is eligible. He has 121 contact versus righties. That's enough. That's part of our rule. Pete Alonso, of course, is not. We're going to have to replace him. Pudge just misses it. I don't know if there's going to be a catcher that reaches it, though, so we'll have to see. Ty Cobb is one of them, and then Bellinger's not. All right, so we kind of know who we need to replace, and let's get started. Actually, we'll make it all vision and all contact, okay? So that's what will be the tiebreaker decider. So Rogers Hornsby has 125 vision. He'll go there. Okay, new rule. They have to have over 120 contact and over 100 vision to be the starter on the team, all right? That'll be the rule. So we're doing high contact and vision challenge. Oh, there we go. Mike Piazza does the trick, 125 contact and 111 vision. There we go. I actually can't use Mike Trout because his vision's below 100. So that's unfortunate. We're gonna have to find somebody else. Okay, so this is the official lineup of the all-contact high-vision team. We got Honus Wagner batting leadoff. You see he has over 120 contact versus both hands, 125 vision. Tony Gwynn, 125 maxed vision and contact. Jimmy Fox, almost max contact with 111 vision. Christian Yelich, 125 contact versus righties, 100 vision on the dot. Rogers Hornsby, 125 maxed out at hitting and vision mike piazza reaches 125 contact versus lefties 111 vision ty cobb maxed out on contact and vision roberto alomar 121 contact versus righties 120 vision and our pitcher obviously doesn't have any of that frank thomas hits 125 contact versus lefties and has a 108 vision lou gehrig 125 contact versus righties 125 vision george brett 123 contact versus righties, 125 vision. Ozzy Albies, 125 contact versus lefties, 112 vision. 
and our boy Paul Molitor, who I've never used, 125 contact versus lefties, 123 vision. Let's see if this is the OP team that we have been waiting for. I hope it is. Now we're at 828 ratings, so we're pretty close to World Series, so it's going to be a few more team builds left before we actually get there. I'm curious what the team build will be to get us into World Series. Hopefully it's something with a decent squad so we have a chance because we're going to be playing better dudes. But let's see what we can do right now with this team. Alright, all contact team, you ready? Are you ready? Look at those high bars. I love looking at that boy. Let's see, we're playing Georgia Bulldogs Preachers Boy. Now it's good to know no matter who he's pitching, we're going to have a fat PCI because that's what happens when you have high vision and high contact. We're facing Willie Mays, Ken Griffey, Pujols, Frank Thomas, Cody Bellinger, Rogers Hornsby, Rodney Moore, Javier Baez, and Jack Flaherty's on the mound. We hit Jack Flaherty pretty well. Why is Nolan Ryan in my rotation? Oh man, I forgot to change that part. I did an automatic computer generated lineup and I changed the lineup but I forgot to change my bullpen and my rotation. I have a weird feeling my bullpen's only going to have one lefty arm in it. That would be unfortunate if this guy's good. So I need to make sure... What's my bullpen looking like? <laughs> yep. Uh, three guys that I don't even use. Kirby Yates, Liam Hendricks, and Goose Gossage. And only one lefty. <laughs> and we're pitching a starter that we hate. I need Nolan Ryan to go crazy this game. Oh my lord. How unfortunate. We need Nolan Ryan to go 7 or 8. Actually, we really don't. Because I can use some of those bullpen arms that I never use. And I don't have to worry about their energy because I'm really never going to ever use them again. And that was hit very far and I don't know how that's not leaving the ballpark. Wow. Okay. Um, doesn't look like I'm fooling anybody yet. That's another good pitch. Okay. Good first inning. Some of them were hit a little harder than they should have been, but overall, no runs. We're fine. Let's go, Hannes. Let's go, baby. All contact team. Look at that PCI. Look at that damn PCI. The lineouts have begun again. Tony Gwynn, welcome back. Welcome back. Ain't none of my all-power hitters hit a ball that hard. Tell me why. Jimmy Fox, back to back. Is the contact team the way to go? Maybe, maybe. You guys, care to explain? This is the best team I've used, by far. That's four in a row, by the way. The best team I've ever used, ever. This is the meta. This is what you need to do in order to win. So, let me get this straight. My two outs are line outs, and my other four at-bats have been all home runs. Let that sink in one time for the one time. Ty Cobb. Quick double. This team's nasty. That's all I'm trying to tell you. Oh, our pitcher's going to come up and ruin the fun. Party pooper. It's okay. We got top of the order again next inning, baby. We got time. By the way, I have Frank on my bench. So that even goes to show even more how good this team build is. I did. I, I let him hit that home run to prove a point to you guys. You know what I mean? I hope it worked. Now I won't give up no more. I just wanted to prove a point. Watch. Now Cody Bellinger's not going to get a hit because he don't have over 120 contact. See, Frank would have killed that ball. Watch, Cody's literally going to strike out because of his low contact. 
Not not that pitch. I'm talking about the next pitch. See, I told you, ass. I, I'm not bluffing. I know what I'm talking about. Uh-oh. Oops, I did it again. In my Britney voice. Dude, Nolan Ryan fucking sucks, bro. Don't do this to me, my brother! These damn check swings, bro. I swear, I will donate a kidney for them to make these better. Tony Gwynn, two for two. He may need to be in my starting lineup again, bro, because in that lefty-lefty game and in this game, I don't think he's gotten out once. And Jimmy Fox has been killing, by the way. Of course I jinxed him. Of course I did. Holy schmoly. This one, Nolan Ryan, really is one of the worst pitchers to touch the face of this earth, though, in this game, I guess. I mean, he just gets hammered. He gets jackhammered. He gets scissored. Let's go, Rogers. Come on, Mr. Hornsby. Let's go ahead and send this one to the moon. You guys, what am I doing wrong? I just want to know. Because most of my outs have been absolutely murdered balls. Good squared up, 104. Good, good with Yelich. I just want to know what I'm doing wrong. Because every time I hit it, well, it's not a bomb. I don't know what to do with Ty Cobb. I hope that I hit a bomb to Jupiter. Let's go. All right, 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 all right. Okay, now, ladies. Damn it. Thank you. Thank you. We'll take that little cushion back on. Quick two more runs, make it a, you know, get it back to a three run game. Oh. Oh. Honus. Let's go, Honey. Come on, Honey. Let's get it, baby. We got to stay out there and. Let's get it, baby. Let's keep going. Let's keep going. Tony Gwynn, you know what he's going to do. You know he's going to at least get a hit. Oh, you could put in a lefty, honey. It, it really don't make a difference. It really don't make a difference. This is the call you all been waiting for. It's the team, bro. It's the team. That's fine. Put in Zach Britton. Put in Zach Britton. It don't matter. Do you get it? Throw the slider. Oh, I was waiting on it, and it just didn't go out. Oh, oh that's right. Oh, Ty Cobb? <laughs> Ken Griffey could never. I got you guessing. I got you guessing. I'm throwing dots now. You ain't gonna get a hit. I'm finna strike you out on this next pitch right now. God damn it, that's a hit. That is a hit, damn it. I threw him out at first. Damn it, no, I didn't. <laughs> He's really not pinch hitting here, huh? Down four with two runners in scoring position and two outs. A bold strategy, Cotton. We'll be seeing ya. Should I legally change my name to Dottie McPhee? Uh, I'll stick with Kyle, actually. Oh, let's go. I'm letting it drop. Let's go, baby. 200 IQ. You guys seen that? That was a manual play. He could have caught that on a line drive. I'm gonna walk. In, I'm gonna walk you guys through this. This is a heads up play. This is what separates people, all right? Look at this. I knew it's Frank Thomas on base, right? He hits that. 
I can easily grab that if I want to. Look it. He's coming forward. I steer him away so he lets it drop. Come back there. Obviously, he would have been able to catch that. Turn the double play because I knew how slow he was. That's 200 IQ. And then you line out after. It's just, that's the way it goes. That's how you do it. Oh! Ty Cobb! You three for three with three doubles, baby? Okay, my bad. My bad, Ty. That boy killing. Ty, Ty, you're being a good boy. Oh, man. Santa is coming to town for you guys because you guys are being absolutely amazing. You guys are just being amazing. No lumps of coal for you guys, I'll tell you that much. Let's go, Frankie. Come on, Frankie. Come on, Frankie. I sound like an old Italian New York dad cheering on his son. Come on, Frankie. Hit it out the park, man. Do it for your mama. And he's a disrespectful ass kid who doesn't give a shit what I say. I might have left early. I did leave early. Good to know. Good to know. Oh no, you guys. Don't let me get in my zone. Don't let me get in my zone. Don't let me get in my zone. I think I'm in my zone. I think I'm in my zone. Send his ass to the Mars. Send him ass to space. Because I am dot in. Oh my god, I'm so clutch. Oh my god, I'm so clutch. <laughs> Tell me that's not a beautiful display of getting out of an inning, you guys. Don't let Honey get in his zone. Don't let Honey get in his zone. Holy moly. We're making it to third. We're making it to third. We're out of third. We're making it to third. Let's go, baby. There it is. Oh, my Lanta. What can I do? What can I do? You guys, this all contact team is disgusting. All I'm doing is hitting the ball. That's all I'm doing. All I'm doing is hitting. I love it. I love it. Your contact is so high. I love it. You have such a high vision. I love it. You have high vision. I like a high vision. That ball is fucking smashed to Mar Mars. That ball is fucking smashed to Jupiter. I'm in my shit right now, boys. I'm in my bag. I am in my bag. Ooh, that was hit hard. Bro, I think all of my, like, probably 90% of my outs have been smashed, too. This all-contact team ain't playing. It ain't fucking playing. Um, so, about that pitch, uh, that was actually an accident. He wasn't even supposed to swing at that because I wasn't ready. I was about to go to the bathroom, and then I just, like, accidentally threw it, and he hit it. So, it's whatever. I mean, we'll just still say it's 11-3, to 3 and we'll just... I don't want to make a hassle, you know what I mean? We don't got to restart the game and everything like that, but... The funny part is, there's people that actually watch my shit that think I'm serious when I joke around like that. Yeah. Uh, Trevor Hoffman's out of the game. Tony? Tony the Tiger? Rawr. Adios mio, I stuck. How the hell is it only 8.49? Dude, I am just giving up tanks. Oh my god!
Oh my god. GG's, baby. My gosh. The all contact squad. Swinging wood. Pushing lumber. 17 hits, 12 runs. Two jacks from Tony Gwynn. Look for that high contact rating. Look for that high vision rating when you're looking for a teammate, boy. Let's get a quick update. We're now at 11 and 2 after starting 0 and 2, so we're on an 11 game winning streak. We're batting 407 with a 1328 OPS in our ERAs below 4, which is fine. Man, we are on a tear now all of a sudden. I love it. Um let me know in the comments below if you guys like this squad, what squads you guys want to see next. I'll be sure to get them ready, all right? Until next time, I'll see you guys later. Peace.